cherries is co-creation. Learning process. Collaboration. Bottom to top, creation. Treat the stakeholders equally. More inclusive, more fair, more efficient. Innovation. Community. Responsible territorial coalitions. Listen to the citizens. Cherries is a Horizon 2020 research project. We are implementing responsible research and innovation processes in healthcare in three European regions. In Murcia in Spain, Europe, Sweden and the Republic of Cyprus. We are using methodologies from responsible research and innovation as well as from open innovation in our experiments. What are, are our experiments? We have a three steps procedure to develop innovations together with our stakeholders in an open and collaborative way. First, we engage them to define needs for innovation. We had an open call for needs. Stakeholders, healthcare professionals, patients, organizations, even private citizens were free to submit needs that they perceive in the terms of healthcare. We selected one need in each region and transformed it into a challenge. This challenge we posted online as a call for solutions. Organizations like startups, SMEs, but also civil society organizations applied with their solutions to these identified needs. We selected one solution in each region and went then to a co-creation process between the solution provider and the need owner on the other hand. Together they co-created this solution to make sure that the solution fits the purpose, fits the context and is well aligned to all the needs of the stakeholders. The co-creation uh, processes uh, brings many benefits for the organization and also for the, for the people who are taking part of these processes, especially when we talk about responsible research and innovation approach because it makes those processes more inclusive, bringing different stakeholders around the table who has a different perspective and different expertise. It's also a question of openness of the processes with different issues that are tackled from different points of view and also it ensures better, let's say, sustainability at the end of the process. To foster sustainability for the co-creation, a key feature is commitment. We have to have commitment from the beginning of the project until the end and beyond, because the end of the project is the beginning of the implementation. We need to see that the project is the beginning of the implementation. Another key feature is incentives. We need clear incentives for the key stakeholders in order to have them to want to commit to the project. They need to see why they should engage and why they should invest their time and their resources into the project. Another thing that will strengthen the sustainability is relationships and partnerships within the ecosystem. What Cherries really helped us with is to map the ecosystem so that we can see where we have partnerships that we might have to strengthen, to build on, or where we have partnerships that we can maintain in order to create sustainability for the solution that we have. Through the Cherries project, we have been able to work on new concepts and challenging methodologies, such as demand-driven approaches and responsible research and innovation. These concepts have been embedded in the methodology of Cherries and have been applied through the regions. They help us identify the common denominator between the call for needs, so it enabled us to develop a proper call for solutions and solve actual and real healthcare problems in our regions. <laughs>